Hi, I'm Jean-François Walking. I'm the studio coach. Today I will show you on a very simple retouch made with uh, two software that I use very frequently to edit my commercial images. One is uh, Lucis Art, which is a uh, software that I use a lot here. This is Lucis Art. It gives a uh, punch and goes and look for detail in images and I will frame it with graphic authority great great selection of frames and I will uh, be using one from the lifestyle selection so here are my two images there are two images of an athlete on a training machine this machine is uh, really new it's a new brand new type and they want to have an image that will just impact not showing too much detail of the actual machine so I'm taking the machine here and running it to the Lucis Art filter in the exposure module there are seven different filters here and I will be using the exposure module by enlarging the image I am changing the image to a point that many detail cannot be recognized but what I'm looking for are details in the machine itself so this level one two three four five here is the level that I'm choosing I will apply this to this image and I will apply the same filter to the other image here so I have the same feeling in both so control F will apply the same filter in the second image so it takes a couple of seconds for the image to be applied there it is so you see it's now a more graphical image and a more kind of graphic art image so I will now drop each image to take the places in the two placeholder in that graphic authority background so grabbing the image bringing it down here so I bring one image let's grab the other one and bring the second image so let's close these two images here to take uh, all our space with the main image let's open to the maximum with control zero here and we have two your image layers here so what I will do I will send one image right there just under the your image and this one also right under the other your image this will activate the clipping mask which is the black mask here and as I take away these two gray images now my image that I have is revealed through so here the image on the right here is the one with the runner looking toward the right so I will control T I will get the image a lot smaller here but still fitting in the window I will get it here fitting in the window by getting him a bit smaller here so enter gives me a proper size here I will now select the other image right here actually I will switch them to make sure that I have my runners which are the same in both looking properly toward the center of the image so here is my runner in one here and here is the second image which is the big one here control T will get it smaller will allow me to transform it freely so here I am let's take the corner turn it a bit here so I have my runner filling all the screen let's get that a little bit bigger here you see it's very easy to get the feeling that you want with the program I am now back to the image on the left again with control T I will just give the a little bit inclination of the image so now you can see the 
completed image and I've just put the two images I wanted under the two placeholder and with these graphic authority template you see right now what we can do very rapidly so I am Jean-Francois Kane with Lucis Art Graphic Authority and the complicity of a light high trainer. Thank you very much.